Come to the uh, one of the highlights of the evening, of course, is the elite race. Uh, we have a small but superb group of female athletes competing tonight. Yes, we do, Harry. And they'll be lining up on the course momentarily. The defending champion, Kenya Sinclair from Jamaica. Kareen Hines, also from Jamaica. Georgina Watson from the United States. Rolanda Bell from Panama. So we have a small field, but certainly will be an exciting race. And we would make the plea as we did at the start to please make sure you are behind the barriers or at least on the sidewalk. We'd hate to see an accident, one of these elite athletes tripping over somebody who has strayed onto the course. So please make sure you are behind the barriers or on the sidewalk. Not too bad for this time of year. We'll just see how well the ladies cope with this, whether it's a flat-out sprint or a technical race. Here we go, four competitors in the elite race. This should be good. This should be real good. We have Kenia Sinclair, defending champion from uh, Jamaica. Corrine Hines, Jorgan Watson, and Rolanda Bell. was St. Clair who ran 444 in the first year and 443 last year. We'll see if St. Clair can go under that time of 443 set last year as they quickly make the turn at the birdcage and head back to the first 200 meters completed, heading back towards us here, right next to the bank of uh, Butterfield. And it looks as if she's already broken away from the pack. And it looks as if she's going to be running against the clock. So yes, it is. Kania St. Clair, really comfortable out there. St. Clair, followed closely by Corrine Hines. And then number 16, Rolanda Bell. Rolanda Bell. And in fourth place, Jorgaine Watson. Looks like it's Kenya Sinclair. The current record holder of this event has been run 344 in her first year coming to Bermuda and last year running a 343.6. But she's leading by some 40 meters already. Looking trim this year. Looking like the Jamaican lion that said she is. Stepping it up. Traditionally known for her world-class 800-meter running feet, now becoming a world-class 1,500-meter runner. She's looking extremely strong this year. Matter of fact, Kenya ran the fastest 800-meter time at the end of last season. So she's a very seasoned athlete. Really looking at one of the best female middle distance runners in the world. Not just in Jamaica. Looking very strong. Not easing off the pace at all. Second place runner, Kareen Hines, her teammate, looks to be fading some fourth bitters. Now running the long tails. Yes, she's here already, people. She's running. She looks to be running at least in the 330 area. Yolanda Bell of the Panama running third. So Gina Watson running fourth of the U.S. But it's all at this point. Kenya and Clev to make strong runner. World class runner. One of the best in the region. One of the best in the world, ladies and gentlemen. Leading all the way. And you by 100, believe it or not. Followed by her teammate, Kareem Hines. Followed by Rolanda Bell of Panama. 
followed by Georgiana Watson. Again, Georgiana Watson of the U.S. Looks to be a little you can, bit of uh, a see the lead car right coming down the finishing straight now. She looks like she is trying to break the racket this year. Will she? 443 is what she has to be. Let's make sure we welcome these ladies home. Trust me, when they come into sight, they'll be moving very quickly. Oh, I'm going to go out on a limb and say it's a new record. Here Probably they come. the only Here they one come. of the night. For Kenya Put Sinclair. Your hands together, please. She's going to break the only record of the night. Here she comes in 433. 433, a new record for the 3 P champion in Kenya Sinclair. Knocking some 10 seconds off of her record. What a performance by the Jamaican. Outstanding performance there. In second place, and Corrine Hines is finishing second, second place. And here, here comes Orlando, Orlando Bell, who will take third place honors in 504. Yet to finish in this four-lady race is George Ann Watson. George Ann Watson. Here comes Coming Watson. Let's help her get to the finish, finish line. line around here. Well done, George Ann. Here's George Ann Watson in 521, well done, unofficially for Watson. Fast running, we witnessed fast running. New record set tonight. 10 seconds, shaving 10 seconds off of last year's time. Kenya Sinclair. New friend from Jamaica, Teddy McCook, the president of NACA. We're very glad to have him with us. And he must be very proud of his first two ladies. So that is very exciting for us. We have a new record tonight by Kenya Sinclair from Jamaica, followed by her fellow Jamaican, Corrine Hines. Third place was Rolanda Bell from Panama, and George Ann Watson rounding out the race from the US of A. Larry is busy collecting the ladies together. Yes. Ruby. As they make their way to the podium. Yep, very shortly. Thank you, ladies. In third place, we have from Panama, Rolanda Bell. This way, ladies. This way. You can do a big, better round of applause than that. Much better, much better. Rolanda finished in a time of 5.04. In second place, from Jamaica, in a time of 4.46, Corrine Hines. And I think we had tonight another flying bolt from down south. We, we know of Usain Bolt. We now know a great deal more about Kenya Sinclair, who broke the record in a time of 4.33 to win the elite women's race. Larry, could we get some impressions from Kenya of the race tonight? Yes, She's indeed. Caught her breath. Yes, indeed. Congratulations. Thank you. This is your second victory. Last year you ran 4:43, shaving 12, 13 seconds off. This year, what's the secret? Actually, this is my third victory. But you know, I came here today, and I decided I was just going to have fun. I've been training for this event because I look forward to it every year. So, you know, I said, okay, I'm going to challenge myself. I want to break 4:40 on the course, and I just went. When you leave here. What's on your schedule from here? Well, I'm just training for right now, getting ready for outdoors. So, you know, I just prepare myself for this meet. You know, just like doing more volume stuff to get myself ready so I could come and perform to the best of my ability. Well, you certainly showed your true medal on the course tonight. We certainly look forward to seeing you again in the future. Congratulations. Thank you very much indeed, Larry. We do have one more presentation, Madam Premier. Uh, there is a school's division, a championship and uh, a trophy is awarded on the basis of participation in the trials and the performance on the night itself. <laughs> Yet again this year, the trophy has been won by Warwick Academy. I'd like to call upon 
Mrs. Angie Berry to step forward. She is the chairperson of Warwick Academy Board of Governors. Madam Premier, if you could make the presentation to Miss Is Berry. And this is the prize both for participation and performance on the night. The schools, the schools trophy that goes yet again, Madam Premier, if you'd like to step in. The schools trophy. Thank you, Madam Premier. Thank you, Mrs. Berry, very much. Thank you, Teddy, once more.